Hi, we're researchers here over the summer with the Yurska program, and we're doing zebrafish models of MS. I'm Kate. I'm going to be a sophomore. I'm majoring in neuroscience and chemistry. And a fun fact about zebrafish is that they've been sent to space. Hi, I'm Eunice. Uh, I'm going to be a senior. Um, I'm majoring in neuroscience. And a fun fact about zebrafish is that they can lay transparent eggs, which is great because you can manipulate them. Hi, I'm Brooke. Um, I'm going to be a junior next year. I'm majoring in neuroscience and minoring in psychology. Um, a fun fact about zebrafish is that they get their names from their stripes on their body that resemble zebras. So Richmond refers to factors that affect the behavior of the fish that could be the natural habitat we're trying to mimic here or in the other room we have two tanks similar to these ones set up that we're continuously playing music to see how Richmond affects their behavior. So stress is one of the behaviors that are exhibited by patients carrying uh, multiple sclerosis. Uh, and that is why we're trying to reduce it using enrichment. Multiple sclerosis is a um, neurodegenerative disease that affects the central nervous system and can result in loss of vision, numbness, and several other. So our first trial is when we put the fish in an empty tank to see a novel tank test. The behavioral test we run, we combine the novel tank and the novel object. First, instead of the habituation phase, we do a novel tank to see whether or not the fish is anxious and stays at the bottom. Then we go straight into the familiarization phase where we have two of the same objects, the one right here. And then we have a tension interval of a minute at first then we put in one new object, and then we have a retention interval of six minutes, and we switch out the novel object with another one, always randomizing the sides. So here we have the EthoVision software that allows us to track behavior and know how long the zebrafish has spent in a certain region. So in our tank, we'll see whether it spends most times either at the bottom or top or during the novel object test, then you will see how long it has spent uh, around either object. This, this software also allows us to see a, a few uh, dependent variables, such as uh, the, different, the distance move, velocity, novel object zone, zone transition, and this can be edited. We can add more or remove, and then um, here you can see the type of data that we collect, uh, it has to be sorted out. So currently we're focusing on enrichment by music, but the broader goal for this research is to induce demyelination in MS model of zebrafish and in hopes of um, remyelinating them later on by environmental enrichment.